Hello, back at Waterloo Recreational Areas, Portage Lake State Campground. It's 96. Ooh, very odd sight as far as trying to level. I could definitely probably work a tent or something where the picnic table is. It's a big white sight, but there's a big tree. 97. Slightly better. Maybe if you parked your camper long ways, you could make something work, but it does not look great. It kind of falls off the road a little bit. Skinny, not deep lot. You definitely have to park the other direction. 98. I'm not sure if you get a camper on the... Oh, it's got a pretty big area to the right of the tree here. You could probably get a, a smaller camper in there and then have lots of room for parking on the other side of the tree. The tree's pretty much in the center of the lot, along with the fire pit. 99 is uh, definitely not level. Um, I'll clear down here is a low spot where it looks a little wet. It just rained. Probably get a camper or smaller camper or tent down here than have the rest of the spot we're using. 100 is oh a nice spot, nice big deep, a little sandy. But if you got a mat, that wouldn't be a problem. The cabin, who someone is running it now, the driveway for that is back in there. It overlooks the lake. Um, that that cabin has a huge porch overlooking Porridge Lake. It's really nice. 100, 101. It's got a drainage deal on it probably get a it's a big wide spot so you definitely can get a medium-sized camper on there the right. 102 nice sight in the shade 102 103 it's a little tricky with the leveling a little high in the back low in the front 104 is all right it does fall off back there by the electrical but it should be a nice cool spot 105 is spot on the right. Big site, but I don't know. That's pretty crazy for level. I freak out if you're trying to put a camper on it. 96, same thing, might be an issue. Big, larger camper and level. 107. Uh, it's definitely mid if you parked it along the road or really short if you parked it here. 107 on the right 108 mid-sized camper would probably be all right not too bad on level 108 along the woods 109 has a good sized camper on it but looks like they chose to have the fire pit on the back side of their camper due to this right side being level issue 110 trees right in the middle of it they put the camper on the left side the fire ring would be behind it this camper and this truck are all on the same lot it's really wide maybe two areas but nothing crazy long should probably go in there these guys 111 did the camp along the rope because it's a nice long skinny lot 12 is similar 112 But it's all uh, dual spots are nice and long. Um, it's shorter campers can park in traditionally. 13 falls off. It has a 113 has a tent on it in the back. It's the level spot. A camper would be difficult on this spot. 113. Not sure what number this spot is, but it's nice. 114. 114 is a nice long site. It's a little funky when it comes off the road right here. It looks like it levels off nicely. It looks like there's a trail that goes in back there. Big secluded area. That's actually a pretty nice spot. Let's see. I'm gonna think that, yeah, 115 is up here. Ooh, 115, not good for level at all. Good. I don't know how you'd make it work. 111. 
think the 111 might be the side on the other. Same as the other side. 109. I'm not sure if these are not just. No, they're not the back side of it. would have to be a real small camper to be on 109. 116, unless that's just the back side of the other street. Very possibly could be. 116 is uh, one you definitely want to park alongside the road because the front to back, it's not very deep, but it's really wide. 117, uh, funky on the, if it's a smaller trailer, real bad the way it falls off the, not much levelness to that site at all. 118, pretty, uh, pretty not, pretty bad on leveling, guys. I have to say, I told you a lot of sites here. It's a huge spot. It goes way back here. They're probably in the middle of it. And then it goes clear to the fire pit and everything down around the other side and up the hill a little bit. So it's a big site, but just awful for level. 119, tree right in the middle of it. A smaller camper probably fit in that gap between the trees because that tree on the right side is probably the one side of the border and the other side of the site is way up here by this picnic table so smaller camper or tents could make that work 120 up here on the left Once again, just brutal on level. I'm not sure how a camper would park on that site at all. 21, there's a 10 on it now, but there is a flat spot about where that 10 is. Not sure how you would use the pit. Oh, it's actually 21 goes, all this big grassy spot up here is 21 also. You could probably pull it in forward, unhook your truck and then park your truck next to it. It's that deep too. Let's see, that's 21, it's close to the restroom. Let's see what number this starts on. This is 136. I'm going to stop here.